Hello, my name is Kishwani. That's K E S H W A N I Kishwani. We are here because we want to prepare for the GMAT. We have been solving math problems out of this book here, the official guide to GMAT 2015. GMAT review 2015. If you do not own this book already, purchase one immediately. You're going to need it. The math problems is what we, are, what we are working on. The math problems that appeared in this edition, 2015, that I'm holding in my hand, happen to be the exact same math problem that appeared in the previous edition, which was the GMAT 13th edition. We have already solved every single math problem from the 13th edition. Instead of redoing the problems, I'm simply going to tell you where to find a given problem. Let's begin, shall we? On page number 161, you will find problem number 68, 69, and 70. Problem solutions to these three problems were presented on page number 281. On page 162, you will find problem, problem numbers 71 through 76. Those were all done on day number 283. Solutions to all the problems are presented from day number 251 through 400. You will find them there. From 251 to 400 for 2015 official guide. Next we have page number 163 where we did problem number 77, 78 and 79 on day number 285. Just type in GMAT math, GMAT math, day 285, the video will pop right up. On the same page on 163 you will find problem numbers 80, 81 and 82. Those three problems were done on day number 287 and finally on page number 164 you will find problems 83 through 90 and those were solved on day number 289. You will find the solutions to all of those problems on these days 281, 283, 85, 87, 89. You will find the solutions to all the problem solving questions on the odd numbers and you will find the solutions to all the data sufficiency questions on even numbers beginning with 252 all the way to 400. Thank you. I know.